Hello, my name is Andy M3FDQ. I'm new to DMR, and a couple of days ago I worked out how to use code plugs. So hopefully we're both at the same level, and if you're watching this video it's because you're new to DMR and you can't work out code plugs. So if your radio looks like this, whether it's a Retivis or a Titera MD380 or the T3 Retivis you see here, this is for you. So you're going to have this software. There is a link at the bottom of this video as well as a link to the South Anglia Repeater Group website with a code plug. There will be one for locals to Ipswich with a few contacts and then there will be this massive file that you're about to see that you can amend yourself and that's why this video is here for you to be able to have the confidence to create your own code plug. Cool. The best way is get a code plug from a friend of course and change it. We've got an Allen. Everyone needs an Allen. The first thing you must do is go into general settings and make sure that Alan hasn't got his call sign in there and his PIN that he was given. So you have to apply for a PIN with DMR to be able to use the radio and again there's a link at the bottom of this video for that. So change those straight away. Then we need to create a contact that we enter into a zone on a channel to be able to talk through the DMR network. The main bit is that in these contacts you have numbers and these numbers dictate where you will appear. So let's show you that. cc-3.info is an awesome website and here's a bit of information that's come through yesterday because the 1st January 2016 the uh, talk groups are changing. So if we want to pop out on all the repeaters in the east of England that are connected together it's talk group 840. So let's have a look at a contact and add in a contact called East Andy, just so it's recognizable for this video. And the number is 840. And yes, I'm not going to cover everything in this video because it just fry your brain. There's no save button here, very odd. Let's do some housework and save as something else because I'm going to show you something in a second you will end up um, erasing the information that you didn't mean to so always do a save so we've created a contact East Andy 840 that's the magic number you need to do that for everywhere you want to pop out on DMR so the next bit is channels okay so here is all your channels and this code plug has got the channels for all of the repeaters in the UK including simplex because you uh, simplex including analog because you can do analog and digital the difference is that down here you need a CTCSS but with digital you need a color code and a slot okay see any difference so what we're going to do is I'm going to make I'm just going to make it so easy I'm going to change an existing one Okay, and we're going to call this um, MK1 for slot 1, and I'm going to call it Alan. There you go, so we can find it later. There'll be another video shortly I'm going to upload, so uh, in the series on YouTube, that will show you where this appears on the radio and how to use the radio. So we need a frequency, an RX and a TX for the numbers for the GB7MK repeater. Here's the bit that really matters. Down here, we need to select that contact name that we called earlier so that we pop out on 840. Everything else is pretty cool because Alan's code plug worked, we know that. Uh, I'm quite far away from the repeater, so I'd leave that as high. Awesome. Again, no save button. But let's save what we've done so far because it's good. So, what we've done is we've got a contact and we've put it in a channel now we need to put it in a zone okay this is the last bit so when you turn your radio on select zones and scroll down to the area that you're standing in that you need to access by radio RF to your local repeater because it's got to have those frequencies in so let's have a look here at this zone okay I'm going to rename this actually for the video you're going to see next and we're going to call it local Andy okay awesome again no save button here so there's 16 channels channels 16 channels available we've only got five so far so whatever you do don't push delete here 
it deletes this here which is a nightmare hence keep saving your work so let's scroll down and find that channel that we changed actually we didn't create one did we okay um, can't find the channel now not that the whole world's watching or anything Alan there it is okay let's add that in there we go so now we can upload to our radio and we can scroll down to the zone local Andy select the 16 digit selector on the selector on the top of the radio till it says Alan and it will pick up the contact and it will pop out in 840 which is gonna be the east of England. Do watch the next video. Fingers crossed it's going to work. And all I need to do now is turn my radio off, plug it into the um, data lead, push this button, and then write to the radio. Turn the radio off again before you unplug your um, cable. And of course, before I do that, I must change general settings here to my pin and my call sign before I do that. Cool. So I hope this has been helpful and let's watch the next video of how to use your radio.